The Art Walk at the Riverview Plaza is to support the damages done to the St. Clair Art Association and to support local artists. We um, at the plaza here, we suffered some major damage, right, this summer from a storm. So a lot of the businesses have been closed and uh, the Art Association got really just decimated. So we started this as a um, fundraiser. There's an artist in the different participating businesses and then they each uh, donated a piece of their art. Uh, to be included in a raffle or giveaway. So we're selling raffle tickets. All the proceeds are going to the Art Association. What we wanted to do is celebrate the local potters as well as expose the other potters that are in and around Michigan. So we have some coming from Lakeport, Rochester, Clinton Township, Ann Arbor, and they're very well seasoned potters if you scan the work. And it was an invitational, so they were chosen. We have scouts going out and trying to discover new artists, and we celebrate them. So this is permanent jewelry. This gives you the flexibility of having your jewelry on at all times without having to take it on and off. So as soon as you wake up in the morning, you can leave the house ready to go. Um, and then this gives you the ability to kind of pick and choose so you can build stacks. So as far as like textures, different metals, you can kind of play with it. So instead of just having just one, you can have multiple. And again, you're just ready to go. Carolyn, the teacher, she would come out and say, why don't you um, make pottery? And I said, well, I'm doing jewelry. She goes, well, you can make jewelry out of pottery. So I joined the class. That's how I started and I haven't quit yet. Um, I'm an experimenter. You know, I like to experiment. I like to have design in them, plus I experiment a lot with colors. Well, a wonderful conclusion to a creative weekend. For Thumbcoast TV, I'm Caitlin Williams.